What's going on? This is Pedram and welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to prioritize yourself in your business to move forward. So this one is actually a big one because I've made a video about this before, what moves your business forward. But this is slightly different because this teaches you how to go about planning your day uh, in order to be more productive and do the things that moves your business forward and makes the biggest impact. So how do you pr prioritize yourself in your business on a day-to-day -day basis uh, that's going to get things done? And it's very simple here. The way I do it, and I've read many books on this subject on how to prioritize your day and how to go about writing it. A list and scheduling it that's going to help you make it happen so uh, usually what I do at the moment uh, I learned a few different ways and I just kind of adjusted my own way and put what's comfortable for me so you have to learn to see what's comfortable for you and what works for you but the way I do it I usually and a lot of other people also have take have a, a list uh, uh, the night before so before you start your day you want to write it you don't want to write it on the on on the same day you want to usually do it the night before uh, and write what i'm going to do today that's going to make the biggest impact so you know in order to start to prioritize your day i want you to take a piece of paper and write on the top what is the best use of my time or put What's the most important activities or the task I should do today to move my business forward? So take a piece of paper and write either one of these will do. What's the most important task I need to do today in my business to move my business forward? Or what's the best use of my time? Any of these will do. So see what works for you i usually use what's the best use of my time in my business today to take my business forward and write down top of the paper and then just write everything that comes into your mind and if every task that comes into your mind so that could be post on instagram could be make two youtube videos it could be send an email to my list so don't Limit yourself here. Just write everything that comes into your mind. Everything and anything that comes into your mind. So by now, you have a list of maybe uh, 10 items in there. And once you got that 10 items in there, you want to then take that paper and look at those the paper and look at all the items and ask yourself, which one of these activities is going to move my business forward? And just focus on those activities. Do not do everything and do not do uh, all, the, all the items in the list. Because uh, maybe one or two, maximum three of those items in your list is going to make your business go forward. The rest of them, you're probably better off eliminating it. Getting rid of it completely. Because, look... All those tasks that are not important, they're probably going to fool you. And they are, the, they are the tasks that are much easier and they are the ones that's more tempting to do. So you're going to realize the task that doesn't really matter, for example, checking your email or installing a plugin, those tasks don't really matter, but they are more tempting to do. So you're going to be tempted and you probably, if you're starting out, you're going to find yourself that you're going to be doing those tasks. And those tasks is not going to move you forward in your business. You got to focus on those tasks that move you forward. And often the tasks that helps you move you forward, takes your business to another level, is the task that is going to be the hardest. So they're going to be the most uncomfortable. They're going to be the one that you're probably going to put off. You don't want to do. So the ones that feels uncomfortable are the ones that you want to focus on. You want to focus on those and you want to get those things done. So any of those tasks could be anything to do with creating a video, emailing your list or uh, sending a um, um, 
do a few Instagram posts. So anything to do with like marketing and 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 uh, uh, customers will not, will 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 become a priority in your business. Anything that helps. Um, bring in revenue and anything that's going to innovate something for the future, maybe come up with a new product, a new service. Those tasks are the main important task, and you want to focus on that. I made a video on, uh, on um, the task that will move your business forward. So if you want to uh, go ahead and see what, what, what things in your business move you forward, just go and look at my channel and you'll find a video on what activities move your business forward and focus on those. But for this video, uh, so take a piece of paper and then once you got the list of those, then you want to look at them and you want to prioritize top three of those tasks. So uh, focus on just three of the most important tasks uh, you have on that piece of paper and try to eliminate as much of them as possible because let me tell you, most of the tasks on that paper are probably not important and you're probably better off eliminating. If you cannot eliminate it, then what you want to do, you want to delegate it. You want to give it to someone else to do. So making a logo, printing business card, any of those tasks there is not a good use of your time. You don't want to be focusing on those tasks because those tasks is not going to get you business anywhere. You want to delegate those tasks to another people or another person uh, because those tasks, again, not going to help you. So get rid of those tasks. If you cannot get rid of it, delegate it and focus purely on those tasks that's going to move your business forward. Example would be an important task uh, would be making this video because this involves the marketing and the people are going to be watching it or emailing your list or coming up with a new product, writing a new offer, you know, writing copy, contacting people one-to-one -one on the phone, um, uh, emailing someone one-to-one, -one, you know, all of these tasks, promoting a webinar, all of these tasks are the tasks you want to be focusing on and is what's going to take your business to the next level. So be careful. It's going to be very tempting to start with to be focusing on those tasks. So uh, look, again, you don't need to complete all the 10 items in the paper that you wrote. You want to just focus on the top three and you want to prioritize them. So put one, two, three in the order of their importance and number one being the most important and number three, number three is the, is number three of in your list. And just focus on getting three done. If you cannot get free done and you find it overwhelming and you find it kind of tough, that's not a problem. What you do, just focus on getting one task done per day. Just one will do the job. Uh, and eventually, over time, you'll see that you got a lot of time. Well, in one year, you probably get a lot of time. And if you focus on the right task, you probably build a very successful business by focusing on the right task. So critical. Um, and then again, Try to eliminate um, uh, the ones that are not important. Uh, uh, if it's if it's uh, if it's have to be done, but it's not important, trying to delegate it. And your job as an entrepreneur, as a business owner, is to focus on the tasks that's going to only move you forward. That's really simple. And then you want to schedule it. So usually you want to do the hardest task uh, beginning of the day because your willpower runs out as the day goes by so you don't want to do the hardest task end of the night where you are tired you want to as soon as you got your list you want to do the hardest item as soon as possible first thing in the morning so in the morning wake up do the things you gotta do eat breakfast meditate whatever then you want to go into that first task and you want to quickly do it and get it over and done with and then that will make a positive impact and you're going to be working on the next one and the next one. And before you know it, uh, you probably done everything in your list and you have a lot of spare time. So make sure that in the morning uh, when you wake up, prioritize and do the hardest task during the day. And one of the things I like to, I like to do in the morning is to, for example, get the workout uh, and, and, and train. Uh, now, 
workout has got nothing to do with business and exercising but in my opinion and a lot of other people it's it's it does got everything to do with your business because it gives you the health it gives you it 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 gives you the oxygen all around your body and you can be more productive if you can go and work out in the morning so when you wake up in the morning i want you to um, take the workout and uh, do the workout first thing in the morning and do the hardest task first thing in the morning because then uh, the hardest task will be out of the way and then uh, you can just complete your day so that's about it really is to take a piece of paper uh, write what's the best use of my time what's the most important activities in my business and then write a list without thinking about it everything put everything down and then look at that list and see what's important and prioritize it number one number two and then number three and you want to try eliminate any task that is not important and you want to uh, delegate the ones that are not priorities and it doesn't really move your business forward delegate it to other people so that's about it really uh, focus on getting the first task hardest task done during the day and if you focus on this system if you focus on the way i told you you will grow your business to a to 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 a level that is a dream for most of the people so follow this if you have a start online if you have an online business or you have any kind of business or you're thinking about starting business this is going to be helpful in getting you started so thank you so much for taking time to watch this video if you have any question or you want to leave a comment please feel free to do so i will be uh, glad to answer any question you might have or a new video in the future and subscribe to this channel for more videos just like this one and uh, i'm also giving away a free video where i show you exactly how i go about making money online how to start an online business and how to do affiliate marketing so the link should be in the description somewhere if you scroll down you'll find the link i want you to click on that link and uh, scroll down uh, and click on that link and it takes you to another page into your name email address and i will give you a full i'll give you that free video i'll send it to you instantly and you can learn years of experience i've managed to gain online so thank you again for taking time to watch this video and if you haven't started your business yet go ahead you start is the best decision you make until next time take care goodbye